So in this video, I want to show you how to use this extension on your phone. So to use this extension on your phone, you're going to need Kiwi browser. You need the Kiwi browser, which is this one, is Kiwi browser. So I'm here on my Kiwi browser and I've typed AIPRM for chat GPT and they'll brought me to that web store, to the Chrome store, the Chrome web store. So from the Chrome web store, all I have to do is click on add to Chrome, which is here. So I click add to Chrome and it will be adding to Chrome. So it's saying add, then I click OK. So it's adding to Chrome because I have the Kiwi browser and it will add. So as you can see, it has added. Now it's asking me to, to log into ChatGPT. Now to log into ChatGPT, I just click log in. Yes. So I click log into my ChatGPT so that my browser can work. So continue with Google. I continue with Google. As you can see, it has logged me into shared DVD. Now from here, I click on done. So when you're inside the phone, you can see that they will be looking like this. The prompt will be looking this like this. All the prompts will be exactly as this. Challenge most people are facing is how to create their own prompt. Yes. So you, you have to just come here and click on add prompt. Yes. After clicking on add prompt, you can add your own prompt. So you type here your prompt. Let me get a prompt. So I'm going to add my prompt here. So if I click Control V, it will paste my prompt, which I made in the previous video. You can watch it if you want. So I've made my prompt. They say prompt template. I've created the prompt template. And teaser, I'll just say recipes. I'll say recipes. And then uh, keyword hint. Uh, I say paste your words here. Paste your words here and then title, you just say also recipes. So then topic, copywriting, uh, activity. Activity, you also look for writing again. Then who can see this? Everyone public, no, this is a private prompt. You say only me, private. Then uh, made for, you say not specific, uh, you choose GPT-3, yes? Then here, Put your name. What a name? Just put something. Uh, put Kadoko. And then a link. You get a link. Grab a YouTube link or something. So I'll just grab a YouTube link for my YouTube video, YouTube channel. I'll grab this one and I use it. You can grab any link and put there. So I'll use this one and paste it here. Control P. As you can see, now I can click Save Prompt and wait to see what it does. So as you can see, it has now saved my prompt. So my prompt has been saved. Now, next, what I have to do is come to own. If I want to see this prompt, come here where I'm saying own. So click on own, and then you will be able to see your own prompt, which is here. Now, if I want to use this prompt, all I have to do is click on this, and then the prompt will be saying here, yeah, paste your words here. So I can say maybe weight loss, weight loss diet, weight loss diet, and then I click on enter. And then you can see that it will generate the, the weight loss diet recipes as I wait and just watch for it to finish generating. And that is how it's going to work. That is how you create your own uh, prompt using using your phone. So in your phone, this is the process you have to do. And remember, you can only create two prompts. So if you go beyond two prompts, you have to pay. So here you can only create your two prompts. And yeah. If if you are tired of one prompt, you can change it to another one. So you can change your prompt the way you want. You can actually ask this chat GPT to create for you another prompt as you use it. So this is the other one, as you can see, and that's how it is. This is how to use it. So it stops uh, generating from here. You can just click on continue and continues.